Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my Generation Beauty haul. Um, I recently went this past weekend, got a lot of goodies, so if you already watched my vlog, you know that this was coming. I'm very excited to be filming this. I got a lot of stuff, so I don't want to make this a really long video. I want to get through it pretty quickly, so let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I want to start off with, because this has the most product, is going to be the Ipsy bag. So this bag... This bag they give you um, right when you walk in or before you walk into the event. So it has a lot of goodies. So let me go ahead and just show you what came in here. First is a coconut oil and shea butter volume hairspray by Mark Anthony. A Moda Pro makeup brushes, Gen Beauty exclusive. So this has three brushes, uh, looks like an eye Let's see, a highlight and glow brush, a triad concealer, and an eyeshader brush. Next is the NYX Professional Makeup California Palette. So these are the colors that are in there. Very pretty palette. Next is Pure Lease. It looks like it's a BB tinted moist cream with SPF 30. So this little cute thing. Then there is a duo chapstick. And it looks like this one kind of looks like the EOS chapstick, so very cute. Next is a Tarte Light Lights Camera Lashes 4-in-1 Mascara. So this is actually a full-size mascara, which is pretty neat. Full-size mascara, so can't wait to try that. And there's a Pacifica Natural Body Care Island Vanilla Body Butter. Next is a little bag from Jouer. So this was a separate little baggie that was in there as well. So this one actually has four eyeshadows. So one, all four um, are the powder eyeshadows by Jouer. And in the shades Amaretto, Marin, Marin, Marinj, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Sugar, uh, Caramel. So all four of those shadows came in that little baggie along with an anti-blemish matte primer so a little mini travel size one and then an anti-aging moisture primer so that was really cool and the eyeshadows are full size so that was nice then there is a mirabella brow pencil or brow crayon and i'm not too sure if there's a shade on this but it's just a brow pencil so very cool um mirabella brow pencil and then the next thing is by j cat is the rocker chic velvet touch waterproof gel lip liner in the shade so fond of you i think this is actually like a nude even though it's in a red box i think it is a nude color oh actually no well i don't know it has a little nude like Part right there so I'll have to check and see I haven't touched anything from Gen Beauty yet it's been almost a whole week and I have not touched anything because I was waiting to film this vlog to try anything out yet so I'll go ahead and try that and see how that works next is a Dermalogica Phytu replenish oil and this one I'm not sure what this does your dewy skin offense so I think this is for like oily skin but I'll have to take a look into it more later. Then I was very excited about this. This is an Hourglass uh, Veil Mineral Primer, and this is actually a full-size primer. So I was super excited when I saw this in there because, Lord knows, you can never have too many primers, even though I am set on my daily ones. I mean, it's nice to have. So this is what it looks like. Very cool. I was very surprised at all the full-size products they were giving. Like, that is just awesome. And then the next thing I got is by Pop Beauty. It's an ink outliner in inked. <laughs> so an inked outliner in inked. Very nice to have liquid liners. I love liquid liners at the moment. So the next thing is by Note. So Note gave us a rich color lipstick in the shade Candy Nude. This one is a very pretty nude. I swatched it on my hand. Very pretty, as you see there, very pretty nude there. Loved it. Then there's another Mirabelle product, and this is a and this is a lip pencil, and it says on there with fluid line texture glides on, creating a flawless satin finish. So I assume this is the color there. Then we got a Milani Eye Tech Extreme liquid liner in black noir. 
So this is the liner. Then this one is very exciting. This one is by The Bomb. This is the Meet Matte Hughes Liquid Lipstick in the shade Committed. So this one is very, very pretty. I was super excited about this. Love their stuff. Then in, we also got Flirt Chick Stick in the shade Ah. <laughs> so I was excited about this. I think, I believe this is Amber Rose's makeup brand. I actually saw her there too. That was pretty exciting. And this is, oh, it's a lip crayon. So that's cool. Full size lip crayon. Very pretty purple color. So next by H2O Beauty, we got an Elements Fresh Powder Exfoliator. So this just says to pour into dry hands, activate with water, gently massage onto your face for 30 seconds and rinse well. So this is pretty cool. Nice little exfoliator. Then by Pixie, we got a Shea Butter Lip Balm. So this was the little lip balm that they gave. Very cute. And then by Derma E, we got a Purifying 2-in-1 Charcoal Mask. So a little sample size. A Note Cosmetics again. We got a Ultra Rich Eye Pencil Color in the shape Deep Forest. This one was really pretty because it's actually that green color that I am obsessed with. So I, if you know, I'll be using this very soon. Then we got, this one was actually at the Ofer booth. Um, they didn't give us a little bag though, so I had to throw this in this one. And this was what they gave out. So this was by Ofra in the shade Hollywood. It's their liquid lipstick. Very pretty color. And then next, by ColourPop, we got an Ultra Matte Lip. This one is in the shade, in the shade Clueless. So this is very pretty. Nice matte lippy. Then we also got a Pure Cosmetics, we got a Mineral Glow Powder, so I thought this would be cool. It's a nice little dark shade, so this might be nice for bronzing. Don't know, I'll try it out, and I'll let you guys know. Next by Cotton Candy, this is in the shade Lemon Drop. I'm not too sure what this is, to be honest. Um, it doesn't even say on here either. I want to say it's like an, a lipstick. Pencil. I don't know. I'll have to open this later and see what it is just because I don't want to make this video too long. So yeah, I'll let you guys know what exactly this was. And then by Eva Nye, we got a therapy session hair mask. So a little sample size of that. So that was very cute. Uh, coming in with Ofra again, there is a long lasting liquid lipstick in the shade Tuscany. So this one was a really pretty mauve nude color, you know, up my alley, just what I love. So very pretty. Love the color, love everything about it. This bag was literally full of so many things, like I'm running out of space to put them on right now, but so awesome, I love this bag. It's full of mainly all my goodies in here. Then I got a Nat uh, Jergens Natural Glow Wet Skin Moisturizer. They were giving this away at their booth. So I believe this one you put on in the shower and it's supposed to um, change your skin tone. I believe that's what she was telling me. So. Very cool. I mean, a wet skin moisturizer, you can never go wrong with that. Next, um, by Lexi, we actually got this really pretty um, blending brush. This is the Lexi 227 brush. So very nice, very cool that they put that in there. I've never tried Lexi brushes, so I'm super excited to try at least one of them. Then by Skin Fix, we got a natural lemon mint lip repair balm for soft, smooth lips. So this might be cool for like, you know, while you're applying your makeup. I know usually when I'm doing or when I start doing my makeup I put on a very thick lip moisturizer so that way by the time I get to like liquid lipsticks or anything like that my lips are nice and moisturized. Then next I got the Brio Geo Don't Despair Repair Gel to Oil Overnight Repair Treatment so that was cool. Very nice little sample size. Next I got the Makeup Forever Mist and Fix so a little sample size of that. And Clinique, all about the eyes, um, eye cream. So that'll be a nice little eye cream there. Can never go wrong with those. Then uh, Jergens Original Scent Lotion. Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Curl and Shine Conditioner. So this would be very cool. Then we got a mini Gimme Brow by Benefit Cosmetics. This was really cool and this one is in the shade 3. I haven't tried their new brow line yet. I really want to. So hopefully, um, I love I love their old Gimme Brow. So I'm pretty sure I'll love this one too. And I need to try the rest of their products. But yeah, I thought this was cool. They give a little mini sample size. So you could travel with it. 
clean up those brows when you need to. And next we got a Belief, the True Cream Moisturizing Balm. So a little mini size of that, that I thought that was really neat. Um, never tried this either, so. There's a lot of stuff in here that I've never tried before, so I'm excited about that. Then we got a sample size Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. So this one would be nice to try as well. Then we got a Fade Defining and Orchid Oil Color Protect Oil. <laughs> by OGX, I believe. So that was cool. They put it in this little baggie just to protect it from spilling in there. Then we got Cover FX Illuminating Primer, so a little sample size of that. Then we also got Freeman Feeling Beautiful Dead Sea Minerals Anti-Stress Mask. This one says it clears, pores, and smooth skin, which I'm all about. Then we got so, soulful, yes, yeah, so soulful gave us a few deep sea masks in here, and then also barrier activator. So, there's a few little sample size things in here, which is pretty cool. Then, Double Dare Beauty gave us a two, two in one kit, it's a detox bubbling microfiber mask. So it looks like this. So I guess you use these two straps. Has instructions in the back. Very cool. I love sheet masks. They're my favorite. Then, um, not sure. And then Yes to Tomatoes gave us a detoxifying charcoal paper mask. So this one's actually a black sheet mask, which I'm super excited about. I've never seen these before, so can't wait to try this one. I think this will be very promising, so I can't wait. And that completes everything that was in the Ipsy bag. Again, it was a lot. I didn't want to talk too much about it because there is so much stuff that we got at Gen Beauty. So I definitely wanted to get that bag done so that we got the most amount of products over with pretty quickly. And now that we got the Ipsy bag out of the way, so that, again, that was the one that had the most product in it. I wanted to really just run by it and show you what I got in there. Now to go into the booths that I actually stopped at and got the free product from. So the first one we stopped at was Pure Elite. So this is the brand there. And then they gave us a full size um, Blue Lotus Brightening Serum. If you have any crazy pigmentation, this would probably be really good for you. So I'm excited to try this. I love serums. I put them on at nighttime before I go to bed and I feel like they just work amazing for me. Then the next place, which I was super excited to stop at, was Derma E. So they gave us this cute little baggie. And then inside, they gave us a purifying toner mist. So along with that little charcoal um, exfoliator that they gave us in the Ipsy bag, they gave us a full-size purifying toner mist. So I thought that was really cool. The um, people at Derma E were super sweet. Loved them. Um, they were so kind. So can't wait to try that and then they also gave us a little little thing of like uh, what is it of like little hair ties so that was cute and this cute little baggie too so I thought that was cool then in the next place, so on Saturday, I stopped at um, H2O Beauty because they were having the meet and greet with Manny. If you watch my vlog, you saw that I met him. I love him. He's great. I'm obsessed. And so um, after the meet and greet, they gave us our free goodie, which was the Aqua Defense Refining Mat Matcha? 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 Detox, detox mask. So it says on here, clinically proven to minimize the appearance of pores and leave skin feeling detoxified. So that was pretty cool. Again, full size product. And that was the H2O product that they gave us. So very cool. Can't wait to try all this stuff out. As it is, I had eye mat stuff fall, or the prior weekend. So now I have eye mat stuff that I'm trying to touch and then I have <laughs> Gen Beauty stuff so very excited I don't think I'll need makeup for a while then we stopped at Skin Fix so Skin Fix they gave us a foaming oil cleanser so I believe this one looks like a sample size I don't know um, it just says for healthy beautiful skin massage into lather on damp skin rinse rinse thoroughly and gently pat skin dry so that'll be very nice i think all these sample sizes will be really good because then you can kind of try them without um you know buying the full product so it smells really good though so i can't wait 
to try that bad boy out. The next place we stopped was ColourPop, so I was very excited to stop there. That was actually the first spot that we actually hit on Saturday, and let me tell you, I was super stoked. I knew that they had just launched their press shadows. I didn't know if that was what they were gonna get. I was super excited because I wanted to try them anyways, and they had said on their Instagram that they would be selling products, so I knew I was going to spend a bit there. So at ColourPop, what they gave you for free is this cute little Ipsy by ColourPop palette. And this palette is an empty palette, of course. So it was an empty palette and they let you choose four shadows. So I thought that was super cool. The palette is very soft. I love that it says Ipsy because it shows, you know, you got a gym beauty. Nobody else will have it except for the people that went. It's very exclusive, you know. <laughs> and then the shadows that I picked out. So these are the ones that are in their collection. Um, one is in the shade High String. A very nice um, brown copper tone color. The next shade that I got is Crisscross. So this is a very nice reddish brown. I was very excited about that one. And I also got Cute Alert. This one was a very pretty color there, a very nice brown. Then they had ex two exclusive shadows that would only be sold at Generation Beauty, and that was Ipster on Fleek. So I got this one. It's a very nice, like, cool tone, purpley gray color. Can't wait to use that one. And those were the four colors that I picked out as far as the, um, the freebie that they gave at ColourPop. And then they were also selling products. So while I was there, I picked up the ColourPop party trick super shock shadow collection so the lady was telling me that this is a set that has shades that were discontinued and they were um, raved about to be brought back so I picked up this so it comes with these nice little um, these six shades so it comes with all these full size shades so super excited to try these I've never tried um, ColourPop shadows so I can't wait to see what these have to offer and the shades here are valley girl birthday girl prickly pear cheap date hot tamale and moonshine so can't wait to try those and they're all very like nude you know dark warm colors so that's always up my alley of what i love so i can't wait to try that and then next i got the color pop in a twist lippy to go collection so this has um crack me up gold digger capish mirror mirror and Next, next, I assume. And these I thought were super cool because they're actually lippies to go, of course. So they have the lip liner on one side. So you have your lip liner for that color. And then the lippy stick on the other side. So I thought that was really cool. Very neat product to have, especially like say if you have like a girl's night out or if you're just going somewhere and you don't want to take like your lipstick, your lip liner chapstick all that good stuff and then you can just take this and it's like your set so i thought that was really cool they come in like they're very pretty like nude dark colors so i that was totally up my alley they have a lot of like a nice brown mauvey tone here a nice darker color and then a nice pink one too so they're all very very pretty i swatched these and i can't wait to try them this was it for saturday so if you watch my vlog we left kind of early and um the lines were pretty long there and whatnot so we had to we left and we didn't even finish half of the booklet at the on Saturday come Sunday um, we got in I stopped at the Lexi booth because I wanted to meet Desi Perkins and Katie and um, that didn't happen because we got evacuated so with that that was all that I technically got. Um, on Sunday when I was in the Lexi booth, they came around with little menus of what they were selling and they let you buy stuff while you were waiting, which is why I picked up a shirt because I was like, oh, why not? I'll just buy a shirt. Got the shirt and the shirt says, wake up and make up. It has a cute little Lexi logo on the side. I thought this would be a cute little pajama shirt. It's a little, you know, it says Lexi in the, on this side and I don't think it has anything on this side. So yeah, I thought this was cute. I loved it and I just bought that. So that was the only thing I got on Sunday. And then while we were in line, um, we had a nice lady come up to us and she gave us Reshma Hen Infused Deep Conditioning Hair Mask. So if you check out their Instagram, they posted a picture of us actually while we were in line. So that was very cool. Um, and I haven't tried this yet, but I, I'm, I really, really need to get into deep conditioners because my ends are getting 
crazy damaged with um, how much I do my hair. So either I need a trim or I need to start taking care of it. So I can't wait to try this. So they were very sweet, came to us in line, and I thought that was awesome. So that completes my haul, sadly. Um, that was all that I got. Uh, it was a lot of stuff, don't get me wrong. It, it came with, the Ipsy bag came with more than enough. And I was happy that I actually got that on Saturday. But um, yeah, that was all I got. I didn't get to touch base with a lot of brands that um, I'm sure a lot of people on here have already um, showed you or you've already seen. But yeah, unfortunately I didn't get to go to those this time around because of Sunday's events that we had been evacuated. So with that, um, I knew I did tell you guys that I would give you an update as to what's going on with that. Ipsy reached out on Monday and sent us an email that if you attended on Sunday to email them with what happened to you and they would see how to um, fix our you know your problem so I said I had already sent them an email on Monday they emailed us on Tuesday I want to say actually I think it was Tuesday they emailed, emailed us on Tuesday so Monday I had already sent them a long email stating you know my frustration because it was I know it wasn't their fault and it was unfortunate that that happened but I just wanted them to know like if there was a way to resolve it if they could so I emailed out I reached out to them on Monday they reached out to everybody on Tuesday um, I just resent them that email when they asked me to respond with what had happened to me with that they did give me 50% of my ticket back so that was cool I wish I would have been able to get all the brands that I missed out on but it wasn't the brand's fault it was more so the event coordination and um, the weather that we were having too here in California so yeah so that's what that ha that's what happened with that so I'm glad that they actually took the time to um, resolve what had happened because I know a lot of people were frustrated. It wasn't fun. <laughs> it was not fun to be in the rain, like to be pushed by security. Like it just, it was a hot mess. So I'm very glad that they took the time to actually get, get it resolved and find a solution for everybody that went. So I'm happy with 50% of my ticket back. I feel like I definitely got my money's worth then for going for one day. So yeah, it is what it is, but hopefully next year or even I might go to Gen Beauty San Fran. We'll see when um, that takes place and how, you know, how it works out. But I might go to that one. That way I can make up for this Gen Beauty. So we shall see. I mean, I'm not too sure just yet, or if not, then just go next year. But either way, I have tons of makeup <laughs> from IMATS, from Gen Beauty. I was super happy with everything. So yeah, I can't wait to try all the goodies that I got. And I mean, who knows, I might end up with new favorites and all that good stuff. So yeah, so that's a little update on what they did to um, fix that. But yeah, I, I had a lot of fun. If I met you there again, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to me. Um, anybody that I spoke with as far as the brands go, thank you for coming and checking out my channel. I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, it's been, it was very fun. It was a great overall weekend. Um, aside from what happened, it was very fun. I met a lot of cool people. I met a lot of great brands. So it was, it was very cool. And I met Manny. So <laughs> my heart is just it's it's complete right now so yeah so thank you guys so much for watching i truly appreciate all the continued support that you guys continuously show me it means so so much to me um thank you for taking the time out of your day to even watch this video if you guys enjoyed it and just let me know um now that i'm done with my beauty events i can film tutorials and stuff like that so let me know what you guys want to see and i'll be more than willing to film that for you and until next time, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.